हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एक्सियोमेटिक कॉस दिस वीडियो इज द पार्ट ऑफ द सोल्यूशन सीरीज फॉर आई आई टी जैम मैथमेटिक्स टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटीन सो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम नंबर फाइव ऑफ योर क्वेश्चन पेपर सो दिस प्रॉब्लम इज फ्रॉम द टॉपिक डिफरेंशियल कैलकुलस एंड इट इज अ वेरी इजी प्रॉब्लम टोटली डिपेंडेंट ओनली ऑन वन रिजल्ट एंड दैट रिजल्ट इन इज नोन एज चेन रूल जनरली वी से दैट रिजल्ट एज चेन रूल so firstly what i will do i will show you that result and using that result we will solve this question quickly okay so so this is the result it is a very basic result from your intermediate level okay although this is not a this is a single variable okay this result holds for single variable right now but it it also hold for several variable i will show you how that works okay so what it says that if you have hx okay if you have hx your hx function is a is a function is a composition of two function okay so if hx is equal to f of gx is a differentiable function then h dash of x is given by f dash of gx g dash x right so this holds for the single variable thing now uh, what we have we have a uh, we have a function which is a two variable function and i i will show you how with this will work here okay now let us write so what do we have okay let me use okay so see what we have we have this function uh g okay we have this function g u v is equal to f of u square minus v square right now it's a two variable function but you have to differentiate it partially with respect to firstly what i will do i will differentiate this partially with respect to u now a notation for that is like this okay so what is that notation g u okay this symbol will represent partial derivative of g with respect to u okay so this is like this so i will represent like this okay it's a general notation so what will happen now so consider this function u square minus v square as a function g that is given in your chain rule okay consider for a while that this function is your g function okay i am i am just writing consider this function as a g and this function as your f function right now what should happen if you are differentiating uh firstly it should differentiate your f and after that it should differentiate your g you are getting my point this is what your chain rule says suggests us so if i will differentiate this function f then what i will get i will get f dash of u square minus v square now i have to differentiate this given function g what is our given function g u square minus v square but now since we are doing partial differentiation so we don't have to worry about the two variable thing you are getting my point or not so if you have this function g u square minus v square then what is the differentiation of it with partially with respect to u so differentiation will be 2u you are getting my point or not okay so this should be gu now if i will evaluate gv then what i will do i will again do the same thing for you okay so using chain rule what i will get i will i have to firstly differentiate your f and after differentiating your f you have to differentiate this thing with respect to u so what you will get you will get 2v okay right so this is what you will get now again differentiate it because what do you need in your question you need uh you need del 2g over del u2 this is what you need right so now again differentiate your g function so your g function g u u okay if you will do this okay now what you have you have this as a function right you have to differentiate this whole function now this is a product of two function right so the first function is this and the second function is this okay this is the product of two function so you have to apply product rule here now let us say i am differentiating this first one okay so what i will get i will get f double dash of u square minus v square okay i am using the product rule for the differentiation that you already know now 
the differentiation of f dash over u square minus v square should work according to the chain rule so there should be 2u here okay so i, I up till now i have just written the differentiation of f dash of u square minus v square okay that should be clear in your mind now 2u is already there okay so this thing is the differentiation of what f dash of u square minus v square now i will differentiate this second function so i should write this like this now what is the differentiation of 2u with respect to u you will get 2 here right now differentiate v with partially with respect to uh, v okay gv with partially with respect to v so what you will get then so okay so this is your gv so again this is a function of uh, this is a product of two functions so firstly i will differentiate this and after that i will differentiate this okay i am using the product rule so if you will do that what you will get you will get f double dash of u square minus v square and again here you will get 2v and minus 2v is also there okay this thing is the differentiation of what f dash of u, f dash of u square minus v square right now here you will get what u square minus v square multiplied with minus 2 okay so you will get this thing multiplied with minus 2 here now if you will add these two things g u u and g v v if you will add these two things what you will get that these two things are getting cancelled right because you are multiplying 2 here and minus 2 here these two, two things will get cancelled so what you will get you will get Okay, you will get 4u square from here and minus 4v square. So you will get g u u plus g v v. You will get f double dash of u square minus v square, right? You can take also 4 out of it. So you will get u square minus v square. So this is how we should proceed. Okay, this is totally dependent upon the chain rule, right? So now let us uh, use black pen for marking. Okay, wait. Okay. So see uh, which option is correct. So this A option is saying that for u square minus v square and f double dash of u square minus v square, right? B option is saying u square plus v square. Okay. Also, okay. I'm sorry here. I have written. Okay. I should use white pen again. Mm, I have written what? I have written plus here, but it should minus here, but it should be plus. You get my point? Because minus 2v and minus 2v will get you plus v square. So finally, what you are getting, okay, I should use black pen now. Okay. So in your A option, it is saying 4u square minus v square. So it is a wrong option. Second is correct. Third is incorrect. And fourth one is also incorrect. So this is how we are going to proceed. Okay, this is a very easy question. So thank you.